Hi, I'm Abhishek, CEO and co-founder of AppSmith. AppSmith is an open source platform that helps you build tools that connect with any API or internal databases. For example, you can build admin panels, reporting dashboards, forms to collect data, or workflows. But how exactly does it work? Let's say you work at an e-commerce company and need a tool where you can manage orders and look up customer information. Now, building a full stack app for this may take weeks, but you can do it in a few minutes if you use AppSmith. I'll show you how. After signing up for AppSmith, you can build a new app from scratch or start with something from our templates gallery. These templates are designed to make it easy to create common apps. The order tracking app looks like the template that I need, so I'll go ahead and fork it. As you can see, this app already has a few features, but I wanted to do one more thing. I need a way to see the details of all orders and be able to make edits to them. So I'll create a new page where I can do this. I've already connected to a Postgres database, which has all the customer and order tables. So I'll use the feature to generate a CRUD page and I'll select my database from the dropdown there. I'll then select the orders table and finally, I'll make the data searchable by the customers column. How cool is this? Now we have a CRUD page ready to use with our database. You can allow users to view or edit any column in this table. This table has features like pagination, filtering, and search. And we have automatically generated all the CRUD queries necessary, so you don't have to write them. Let's add one more feature. I need to add a graph to show total number of sales next to the revenue chart. To do this, I'll create a new query called Get Sales. With the help of AppSmith's AI, I write a SQL query to get the total sales per month from the orders table. Running this query pulls the relevant data from our database. Now I'll head back to the canvas. I'll drag and drop a chart widget that I can configure to show the sales data. We support hundreds of types of charts. To use the chart widget, I'll write JavaScript to map over the response of my query and then display sales data for a given month. You can write JS anywhere or use any JS library inside AppSmith. Nice. With this, we've completed our order management tool. I'm happy with this, so I'll deploy this application. Since I want my team members to also use this tool, I'll now invite them. AppSmith takes care of authorization and authentication flows, so you don't have to build them. Now we are done. Within a few minutes, we've built a custom app to manage our orders. We can view a summary of our orders and revenue, look up customers and their orders, edit any order details, and the best part is anyone from my team can use this app. We've just saved a ton of time and effort. AppSmith can be self-hosted using Docker, Kubernetes, or an AWS or Azure machine image. The possibilities with AppSmith are endless. You can use our UI widgets and data source connections to solve any internal business need. Go to appsmith.com to start using us for free.